Hey guys, here I am showing off my, my house. This is my first house that I've ever built in the entire world ever. And I did it all by myself with no references or anything like that. I think I did a really good job. So here we have the the front of the house right here. We got uh, we got a little one singular fence, and that's to keep people from falling off from the front of the house. Um, got a nice little window and a door. Over here we got a roof, a little chimney for the fireplace that this house the house doesn't have. Over here we have this. Uh, this is a modern art very modern and uh, contemporary over here we have a nice little pool um, for swimming and a fountain just as more modern art contemporary modern art uh, over here we have a, a nice little tree some some foliage going on a little water feature some logs maybe there's frogs living over there it's a two bed one bath house that could uh, that's that's got a very open concept um, and it's very modern and minimalistic and contemporary um, and uh, I figured the best place to start was here in the living room I went for something very mid-century modern uh, contemporary minimalistic uh, fireplace there's the fireplace I lied there is a fireplace I was just joking earlier um, we've got uh, a little cat tree for the cats uh, beautiful plant um, very modern art um, you know th modern art it's got some vintage vibes to it it's got vintage vibes all right uh, let's go over here we got the kitchen it's a it's a lovely little kitchen uh, I went for very something very modern uh, very fancy very contemporary minimalistic um, with a, it's got a window over here is um, it's the dining room uh, right here we have uh, some more modern art uh, there's the Sun on the wall it represents um, youth and longevity <laughs> if we turn around and we head over here we head right into this is the master bedroom uh, it's very minimalistic contemporary modern uh, with uh, beautiful art and lovely greenery plants um, there's a ceiling fan in this one wanted to go for something a little different uh, yeah and then let's head on down the hall here um, it's I went I wanted to go add a little bit to the hall make it a little bit interesting uh, like over here there's a, some more modern art uh, this the Sun obviously representing youth and longevity um, coming in here is the child's bedroom uh, here at uh, Chip McDippy Co Company and Company. We wanted something for the children that would keep the children happy and healthy. So we got a bed and, and a little workstation for homework. Heading on down the hall again, we have, you know, I think I talked about this house is very full of very modern uh, art. It's very lovely, very beautiful. You know, the sun represents uh, youth and longevity. Um, and that Moving on into here, this is the uh, the bathroom. Um, I worked really hard on this. Wanted to go for something very modern and uh, and uh, in-house chic. That's a, a very real style that exists on this planet. Uh, we got something for the cat too that would be living in this house. Um, you know, uh, uh, it's got a sink and a mirror, and uh, it's got a it's got art. It's very lovely. A bathtub can't go wrong with that you can clean your your cat in there um, over here we have the office just across the hallway uh, a place to get work done you got your workstation art for inspiration and um, and youth <laughs> and longevity and then uh, uh, you know you can do art and there's more uh, because there's art here it might inspire you to do art and then you got your games table for games because um, we like to play games around here. This is a very a youthful household where we like to play games. And just down the hall, if we head out the back door, uh, we'll see the, the wonderful garden. 
It's very lovely. Um, we have a garden. We have a sitting area for, for people. We have the sun, which represents youth growth because the sun grows the plants. Everybody knows the rules. Right here, we have a uh, um, uh, a bird bath and a light. When it gets night outside, you don't wanna you don't want it to be too dark so that you can see your plants grow. Hey guys, it's Chip. Just wanted to thank you guys for watching the video. This video was obviously for fun. I know we've all played The Sims and looked at the build mode house or whatever you want to call it, and thought, hey, I want to build that. Unless that's just me. Anyways, I'll have this available for you to download and uh, place in your very own world. It'll be under McDippy Chip. Uh, I just wanted to mention I'd never planned on making the interior. It's like two levels underground and very unorthodox. If you guys want to go in and redo it yourself, by all means go ahead. I'd love to see it. Uh, the version I upload to the gallery is all base game, so I got rid of the cats and dogs stuff so anyone can download it and do whatever you want to it. Again, it'll be under McDippy Chip. I'm sure I'm not the first to do this, but I had a lot of fun making it, so please leave a comment. I guess that's all I have to say. And just like Grandma, I'm on my way out. <laughs>